Hey Eagles, welcome back to ETV. I know it's been a while, but we have a great lineup for you today. Let's start with some info. Hey Juan, look at this cool photo I took. Wow, Ben, that's a really nice picture. Where did you learn how to take it? Oh, I took it in Photo Club in room 1508. Their next meeting is next Tuesday. Hey Ben, have you also heard about the Houston water boil notice? It was lifted last Tuesday. Oh, I'm hoping more people come to room 1508 to sponsor their clubs on ETV. But they gotta talk to Mr. Burroughs for more information. Oh, USA beat Iran 1-0, so they'll be moving on to the World Cup. Oh, that's really nice, Ben. Well, it was nice talking to you. I'll see you later. See you, Juan. Our crew's so creative. Let's see what they're cooking up in Mod Media. So f them niggas look at me. Wild up on your tell your man I'm sorry. You know, I'm kinda curious what's happening on the streets. Let's find out. I had never gotten any Christmas presents. That's unfortunate. Anyways, uh, a spatula. I don't get weird presents. To be honest, I don't know. Socks. Chicken. <laughs> Probably just like five pairs of socks. Not in like a, a wrapper or anything. Just five pairs of socks. No, not even wrapped? No. Just out in the open? Five pairs of socks. Like, not even in a... Like, in the stocking, in the packaging? No, just five pairs of socks. That was it. Okay, cool. Who has weird Christmas presents? You'd be surprised. A weird Christmas present. I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, I don't know. You'd be surprised I by... I I did, actually... My teacher, no, no, I'm dead serious. I put a picture up on the screen. Uh, I actually did get a uh, taco shell. So it was like a secret Santa. Yeah. It was a secret Santa for uh, B Square. Mm -hmm. And Miss Han, we were doing, Miss Han was my secret Santa. Yeah. And she got me taco shell. <laughs> Your 
You're probably wondering why I'm here. Well, we kind of ran out of budget for the zombie stuff. But... <laughs> Uncle was a little bit scary last time. Let's see what they're up to now. Okay, guys, I'm really disappointed in this. Y'all's attitudes, the way you've been acting towards each other. Come on, really? I'm actually bringing in somebody to help the group morale, right? Here he comes now. Hi, I made you guys some cookies. Bro, I'm so excited for this. I really don't like the vibe he's bringing, you know? Like, four is a perfect number, and five is just odd. I mean, I don't care. <laughs> They're all, like, the same person. It's like copy and paste. Here you go. They're homemade. I made them for you guys. Oh. Uh, what kind is it? Oh, they're oatmeal cookies. I'm allergic to that. Uh, Kobe, we need can it. I like have one though? Uh, yes. Of course. No. <gasps> no. <laughs> what the heck? I don't like him at all. Okay. Hey, Delaney. Yeah. I'm really sorry about like earlier. Like, I, I really didn't like. I didn't know about your allergies. I'm so sorry. About that. I forgive you. You do? Yeah. Hey, I, and I know something that'll probably cheer you up. What about some music? Music? Like, what type of music? You know? I think he's warming up to me. Zero's actually really good, right, Kobe? Yeah. Hey, your name's uh, T, right? Yeah. What's up, man? I mean, them cookies was weak, but the gesture was nice, so I mean, I'll. I'm recording you. Hey, what's up, guys? Oh, hey. No. Oh, by the way, those things are really good. I actually think it's like pretty yeah, cool. Maybe. Like, we were just talking about airplanes and stuff. Like, I don't know, that's so dope to me. Okay. Are you I really? Can bring, I can bring it. Man, I'm getting Next along with like everybody. They're so fun. Someone even likes airplanes and like the same music taste. Oh, and I, I see now. I still don't like them. I'm gonna enjoy. Um, wait. Gabe, was it? Um, where'd you come from before? <laughs> oh, I did music back with my last group. Mm. Doing, so. He's really easy to like talk to, you know. Okay, like, I just talked to his like old group about how he was. They were saying he was not a good person at all. I'm gonna Kobe, shut up! You think someone's gonna randomly look, Kobe, make cookies? Look, look, there's one thing in this group that we don't like, and we don't like liars. I will understand if you came over here with some evidence and hard facts, but like you just. I literally just talked to his old group. Dude, that's so that's so you do not. Kobe, you're pointing at. There's no group over there. He's literally putting y'all on. Guess what? We're bringing back Jolly Ranchers, and not just for saving the world. Here's our East Water Land. I'm here with James. Uh, Jesse. Zakira. All right, for the first question, what reindeer has a red nose? Rudolph. 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 Rudolph! That is correct. Oh you my have one God. Jolly Rancher. The next question, what is the name of the day before Christmas. Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve? <laughs> Christmas Eve, <laughs> right? Christmas Eve. Correct. You got that correct. Good job. <laughs> For last question, double or nothing. Oh. Final question, double or nothing. You have two Jolly Ranchers so far. You can opt out if you want. Oh. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Sure. Yes. No, I want it. Yeah. Okay. So yes? Yes. Okay, okay. <laughs> Who is Santa's evil opposite? Krampus. Evil Santa? <laughs> evil Santa. You're gonna go with Evil Santa? Krampus. Is that your final answer? Yes. Is that your final answer? Yeah. Yeah. He is correct. That is incorrect. That is correct. She got it wrong because we helped her. The answer was Krampus. Hello Dawson Eagles, my name is Aiden Graham and you're watching ETV Playoffs where multiple TV shows and movies compete against each other to see which one is a better one. ETV Playoffs is where you, the student of Dawson, go around the school and look for the QR codes shown to my left and then scan it and then vote for the competitors. Each week the competitors will change. You have until ETV is shown which is on Thursday. On Thursday, December 8th, the first poll will end and we'll be eliminating the bottom 8 contenders. On Thursday, December 15th, we'll be getting rid of the bottom 4 contenders and start getting ready for the finals. The finals will end on Thursday, January 12th and the winner will be crowned on the exact same day. This will mark the end of the first season of ETV Playoffs. Man, I love sports. Let's see what's happening on ESN.
Hey, my name is Moises. And I'm Darian. And, and this, this is, is the Ascent. Our women's basketball team had a non-district game against Lamar. And their non-district record is now 7-7. Did you know our men's basketball team is 6-1? They're taking butts and kicking. They're taking names and kicking butts. Dude, really, do you have to mess like you're literally really just This isn't even Liam. <laughs> Try being an actor. <laughs> Try being an actor, Liam. We had an overtime showdown versus Manville where we came out on top 56 to 52. Why are you looking at me like I made the mistake? On Tuesday, we had a game against Seven Lakes. Here's the score. Their next home game is December 9th, so come out and support our Eagles. Now on to the clips from the Manville game. Whoa, whoa, wait. First, what about the World Cup? Everybody rise up, stand up, it's that time. Come on. We got Portugal, we got Mexico, France, England, Brazil, Belgium, Qatar, Germany, USA, Iran, Canada. Argentina, Australia. Let's play football. It's Ronaldo, it's 1-0 Portugal. Two! He to play there, soccer, plays with a bit of first you'll need two teams. I've had enough, please. The goal please, of the game Austin. is to score. Тоже Неймар. Один раз, нет, уже два раза получил по ногам. Один раз с него сняли футболку. Это, конечно, так. Франция, если ты, Пари, Эмбаппе! Isn't this a little dramatic? I'm only graduating a little early. Anyways, this is where our journey ends. Hope you watch next week's episode. This is Ileana signing off for the last time.